Mastering Money Transfers, a comprehensive guide. Hello everyone. Today we're going to dive into the world of bank transfers. Specifically, we're going to learn how to transfer money using a routing and account number. By the end of this video, you'll have the skills to transfer money securely and efficiently, so let's get started. What is a routing number and an account number? First things first, we need to understand what a routing number and an account number are. A routing number is a nine-digit code used by banks in the U.S. to identify themselves. It's a way to pinpoint exactly which bank the money is coming from or going to. An account number, on the other hand, is unique to your specific account. It can be found on your checks, your online account, or can be obtained from your bank directly. Together, these two numbers uniquely identify your bank and your account within that bank. How to find your routing and account number? You can find your routing and account number on the bottom of your checks. The routing number is usually on the left, followed by your account number, and then the check number. If you don't have access to checks, you can also find these numbers on your online banking account or by contacting your bank directly. How to initiate a transfer now that we have our routing and account numbers let's go through the steps to initiate a transfer one log into your online banking account almost all banks now support online money transfers two navigate to the transfer section this can usually be found in the main menu three choose to make an external transfer this option might also be listed as transfer to another bank wire transfer, or similar. 4. You'll be asked to enter the recipient's bank details. This is where you input the routing and account number of the person or entity you want to transfer money to. 5. Enter the amount of money you want to transfer. Be careful to double-check this amount to avoid any mistakes. 6. Review your transfer and confirm it. You may need to enter a confirmation code sent to your phone or email, depending on your bank's security procedures. And that's it. You've now successfully learned how to transfer money using a routing and account number. Remember, always double check all information before confirming a transfer, as mistakes can be difficult to reverse. With this knowledge, you can efficiently and safely move money to where it needs to go. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.